Lost Landing, which is in Monterey Bay. It took about two weeks to get down here. He said just had wonderful weather, it kind of been spoiled with the weather we've had. But um, she's a 135 foot vessel. She draws about nine and a half feet. Um, Unless you're in the Gulfport Harbor, she draws seven and a half. Seven and a half out of Gulfport. <laughs> <laughs> we'll, we'll ballast it to make sure. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, um, 296 regulatory tons. Let's see. Hmm. Trying to think of uh, what I, I want to tell you. Like I said, I was explaining to everybody, we normally don't have all this gear laying about on board. Uh, it's cheaper to transport it from on the boat than it is to have it shipped in from California. It has two Caterpillar diesels, each pushing about 550 horses a side. And then it has 23406 uh, Caterpillar generate uh, diesels turning 125 kW generators. We normally only run one generator at a time unless for whatever reason we need additional power. And also coming and going out of port, we normally run two just in case we have an issue with one. The one's already on line. I've been working close with uh, the old captain, Rick Bellini, who, uh, if he's not, he, I think he got off, off to go get a hotel for the night, but um, he's been bringing me up to speed. It's been huge help having him on board, explaining all the systems. Um, we worked, uh, the engineer that was on board, he went through everything. We have, we run two engineers. Uh, one engineer's always awake. Um, they work 12 hour watches, and so, um, had a few uh, few things we're learning about the boat. It doesn't have an air, air condition in the wheelhouse. <laughs> I guess you don't need that in Northern California, whereas uh, yep. we it'll be one of the first things fixed uh, <laughs> once we get to Gulfport. It's actually it's funny. We actually have a hose run up from one of the air conditions trying to pump some cool air up there. But we've been keeping the doors open and keeping a breeze going through there. But that is one of the first things we'll address once we get to Gulfport. Um, he said, other than that, uh, I think it has accommodations for 21. They're, they ran a crew of eight or nine on board. We'll, we'll do similar. Uh, we might run a crew of eight, but th that'll, all be that'll all be worked out later on. So, um, not, sure, uh, not sure what else to tell you. 